My name is Michaela Holliday, and this is my status report presentation. My old research question was, does being in the foster care system increase the chances of someone becoming homeless? If so, how and why? This research question did not work for my topic because my topic, my research question needed to be more specific. My new research question is, does being in the foster care system increase the chances of youth becoming homeless after aging out of foster care? If so, how can a mixed method study combat this issue? The first source that I chose to present is by Johnson and Piers, From Youth to Adult Homelessness, the Australian Journal of Social Issues. Um, this source uses theming and coding to find answers within texts and interviews, um, and they also use a psychological aspect to get into the minds of homeless youth to figure out why they are homeless after aging out of the foster care system. This source provides an insight into the minds of the homeless population, the homeless individuals, and it also provides a possible solution to my research. The second source is by Elizabeth Alman, Supporting Youth Aging Out of Foster Care from the Pediatric Nursing Journal. Um, this source goes into detail about the challenges youth face during and after aging out of the foster care system. This source focuses on one aspect, that youth with meaningful relationships have a better chance of success in life than youth without meaningful relationship. And this source, again, offers a possible solution to my research. The third source I chose to present is by Schofield and Pierce, More Than Just a Seat at the Table, The Power of Youth Voice and Ending Youth Homelessness in the United States from the Child Care and Practice Journal. Um, this source um, aims to completely end youth, homeless, youth homelessness in Austin, Texas by, um, with a program called Youth Homelessness Demonstration Program, YHDP. Um, this program uses youth to help youth. This program is built of a board of professionals um, and is, but also has a, um, a board of 12 youth decision makers who speak for the homeless population. Um, the, 12 youth, the 12 youth representatives are deeply involved in every level of the planning process, um, and this source provides information on the foster care system and provides to me a possible solution for my research. My methodology. Um, my methodology is a mixed method because I will be interviewing professionals but I will also be distributing surveys to the homeless population through those professionals. Um, I will be using theming and coding to find connections between sources previously written that I gathered and between the answers that I get from the interviews and survey questions. I will be trying to find a correlation between foster care, the foster care system and homelessness. My next steps are getting the, my IRB approved and um, to begin interviews and surveys and begin writing. My anticipated challenges are contacting professionals. That will be hard to do because of the pandemic that we're in at the moment. Um, distributing surveys to the homeless population will also be difficult because I will go through professionals and hopefully get them distributed um, to the homeless population safely. Um, I, I may not get them back and I may get incomplete surveys because um, the homeless population is very, um, is very discreet about their living situations. And so um, getting complete surveys back um, or even getting them to fill out surveys will be a challenge. Um, I may get unanswered interview questions just because um, professionals may not feel comfortable answering questions about, um, about the homeless population, about homeless people that they know. They may, um, it may feel more personal to them. And so, um, that may be difficult as well. 
another anticipated challenge of my research is being able to um, to do the interviews and surveys um, in an ethical manner, which means um, getting all of the survey answers and interview answers um, in a manner that protects all of the individuals. That was my status report.